stoners are not lazy. I feel like that is so cliche. We've heard it since we were young. All those campaigns, stay away from marijuana. Stoners are lazy. They don't do anything where I am way more productive when I have used cannabis. I make my to-do list every morning. I'm practicing my yoga, taking my dogs on walks, going on adventures with my partner and my dogs. I crush it in meetings because I am way more focused. Brainstorms have become way more fun because you're integrating cannabis into them. So I definitely classify myself as a productive pothead. I'm Megan Cunningham and I'm a PR and marketing professional. I've also been in the cannabis industry for almost a decade now. I'm also a yoga teacher and I have been using medical cannabis for over a decade to help with my anxiety. My anxiety in high school was undiagnosed. You're growing up, you're trying to figure out who you are, who you want to be, maybe not surrounding yourself with the most healthy relationships at that time. For me, it was a partner and it just, it definitely caused a lot of inner anxiety. So whenever I was using cannabis, especially with my friends, I was able to just have fun, relax, let go. As I continued to use it more, I also was starting to consume before I'd practice yoga. And then when I would get out of class, I would smoke a joint and I would literally just feel like I had broke down some walls. My anxiety would be at its side. I'd forget about the things I was worrying about. It was really neat for me just to first identify that the plant was helping me and then also continue figuring out, okay, it's helping me in X, Y, and Z situations. I remember my first time in high school when I tried cannabis. I was extremely nervous. I was in one of my friend's rooms at a party. They had this huge bong and when I hit it for the first time, I ended up getting dirty bong water all over my friend on his white sweatshirt. So I would say in college is when I really started to explore more for the medical benefits of the plant versus only focusing on the recreational side of it all. I started to explore different strains, different ways of consuming, and just noted internally what made me feel the best and what really helped. And my dad, who is sober from alcohol, has been since he was 19, also started getting into using cannabis after his sister passed away from cancer. He went out to California, he started seeing how the plant was working for her to alleviate her actual physical pain and also give her an appetite when she was going through chemo. And that really opened up his mind. He used to use back in the day, but of course he stopped using after he got completely sober once he had kids. So for him, this was new territory, but one of the really cool things about it was we were able to explore this journey together. He started consuming again, but for him, it was almost like a new life started to happen. And for me, it was just really cool to witness that change in him. My mom, although she's not someone that consumes cannabis, she can obviously see the difference in both of us and how it's helped us. If anything, I would say like, the plant has definitely made my relationship with my father even stronger. I never thought that I'd be smoking with my dad, ever. What really pushed me to want to get my medical card is I was scared that the medicine that I was using daily would be taken away from me, that I wouldn't have access to it. And for me, that really started to make me panic. I was able to get my card very quickly and it's been a godsend. When you are exploring cannabis medically, I do feel like you are more intentional about how you're using and going to the dispensary is fun. Going to explore the new products they have, the promos, because here in Massachusetts, when you do have your medical card, you are able to get promotions and discounts. One of the other things that I love about having my medical card is I don't get taxed. And it's as simple as that. I love being able to have access to my medicine, but also I'm being mindful of my spending too. When I didn't have my medical card, I was spending way more money. I would love for parents to start talking about 
cannabis with their kids at a younger age. I know for me, that's definitely what I'm planning on doing because the plant is a medicine and I don't want to have any shame or feel like I'm hiding something from my kids. Obviously, when they're young, I don't want to have it out in the open, but I really commend the parents now that are starting to have these conversations with their kids. So they're not looking at it like it's something extremely taboo, something that we should be ashamed of and hide. The parents that I know that have done this, it's not like their kids are wanting to try it. They just say, oh yeah, that's that's mommy and daddy's medicine. I've definitely experienced some backlash with people when I tell them that I'm in the cannabis industry. Sometimes I would just fully avoid saying that, just saying, I'm in PR, I'm in marketing. Now, I do still feel out who I'm talking to, but I am way more aware and proud to say that I'm part of the cannabis industry and I'm way more equipped to explain the benefits and why this is helping people like myself, my dad, others on a medical level. And I also never thought that I'd actually be in the cannabis industry too, but now I can't ever see myself leaving it. I'm definitely very honored to be a voice for this industry and also an example of someone that consumes on a daily basis and I'm successful, I'm a professional. You can do all these things and be a cannabis user. I use cannabis every day. I honestly don't know where I would be right now if I didn't have the plant with me on a daily aspect. There's some days where I'm only consuming a little bit, there's other days where you know, I need to consume more. I love to consume in the morning. It really helps me just get my head right, gets me in that frame of mind where I want to conquer the world. And whether it's in the morning, afternoon, or at night, I'm a better writer. I'm a better strategic thinker. I feel like I am more open-minded too. And it also trickles into my professional world as well. It's just positively impacted my life across all fronts. Learn more about cannabis and begin your medical cannabis journey at leafwell.com.